Well, it's certainly starting to feel a lot like Christmas in our nation's capital. A cold, wet day today, but we're inside a Capital One Arena as the Georgetown Hoyas come back home and try to stay hot. They're supposed to beat UMBC. The question is whether or not they come out consistently. Looks pretty good so far. They're off to the right start. And getting out in transition, Ryan Odom already sees something he doesn't like. He's going to call for a timeout. A terrific job right here of swarming. And look at the basket, kind of threw it up there, almost fearful of the block. A little cut down from the baseline, and it was Allen once again with a pretty bounce pass. 45% on the year, similar numbers to Georgetown from the floor. Now Pickett on the fadeaway guy. Side, it's Jackson. Got it. First points of the game come just over seven minutes in. Your problem for this team this year. Something they've got to avoid, and there's another foul, a chance at a three-point play. A little quick on that shot. But one. And pretty quiet here offensively in the first half. It gets two there. It looked like he did a pretty good job. That would have been better off with a no call. Nice. That's a terrific look from McClung inside. Heck of a battle this year. Maybe more wide open than it's been at any time since they restructured the Big East. There's seven. That's nice touch on the fadeaway. Talked about Omar Yurtsevin, one of those kinds of guys that's got a lot of skill in the post. He's showing us what he has on the block. Got clock winding down, though, on a turnover. Jackson turned right back over as Mosley jumped in to poke it away. Just outstanding great look. Outstanding anticipation by Mosley leads to that great look. You said it's a retriever's team at... the ball he's moving right there before he catches it he sees the lane and highlight film Mac McClung oh. once again good ball movement that leads to another Georgetown dunk this team is going to be the rest of the way after a radical change to what they are that's working. Very good inside the America East. Trying now for a fourth straight 20-win season. This is going to be one tonight. But... Jackson, good look inside, and Aachen came wide open. As we said, he might end up getting some playing time in spots with the shorter bench now. As the runner is good for Owens. Owens wanted a whistle. He's not getting it. It's 71 to 43. You probably won't hear a lot of it. That's another pretty no-look pass to Von Blair. In that, 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 in that evaluation. That's a gaudy number. Absolutely. And he would have expected it with some of the losses that they suffered. Time winding down. Efficient night for Georgetown. They jumped out to a 14-point lead, led by 18 at the break, and they win it tonight by a score of 81 to 55. Devin Dotson leads top rank Kansas against Sadiq Bay and number 18 Villanova in a matchup that's usually reserved for turning time. What a jam! Saturday at 11:30 Eastern on Fox.